The next part in my Seven Deadly Sin series is lust, so as I draw this, I'm going to tell you a true crime case about how a devoted husband's double life led him to murder his wife. In the late 90s, Craig Rabinowitz called the police when he found his wife's body in the bathtub. He said it was an accidental drowning, but people didn't believe that. People's doubts were proven right when the cause of death was ruled a strangulation. Then, what investigators found would shock them. Craig had the appearance of a successful, wealthy businessman and devoted husband, but he had a secret. He had been spending all of his money on Summer, a dancer he met at a club. He had become obsessed with her and would spend thousands of dollars a week on her. However, please note that Summer was not to blame. Craig's actions are entirely his own. But because Craig had spent more money than he could make, he needed a plan. He took out a $1.5 million insurance policy on his wife, naming himself as the beneficiary. Then he strangled her, and prosecutors think he dragged her body to the bathtub based on the bruises they found. Prosecutors also found a suitcase with thousands of dollars in cash ready, proving that Craig was ready to flee after his wife's funeral. And that's how a man's secret life led him to murder.